essential elements of contract we have defined what is contract a contract should have following essential elements the term essential means all of the following elements must be present and satisfied we will very briefly explain the essential elements for understanding in later classes we will explain each of these terms in more details offer and acceptance legally binding relationship lawful consideration capacity to contract free consent lawful object certainty statutory rules performance consensus offer and acceptance there must be a clear and unambiguous offer by one party the offer must be clearly understood and unconditionally accepted by the other party to create an agreement example a shows his car to b and asks i offer you to sell this car at rupees 1 lakh this becomes offer by a to b b says yes i will buy this becomes acceptance by b of a's offer now it constitutes a contract legally binding relationship the contract must be intended to create a legally binding relationship between the parties presumption of legal relationship personal agreements in personal agreements there is a presumption that the parties do not intend to create legal relationship commercial agreements in commercial agreements there is a presumption that the parties intend to create legal relationship example a invites b to a dinner b agrees to attend this is not legally binding agreement so no contract is formed consequently a cannot take any action against b if b does not attend similarly b cannot take any action if a fails to make arrangement for dinner example an agreement having a clause like shall not be subject to legal jurisdiction in any court of law is not enforceable as there is no intention to create legal relationship lawful consideration consideration means the benefit that the parties would accrue for which they intend to make the contract the contract must involve some lawful consideration benefit etc no consideration no contract example a saved b's goods from fire without being asked by b a cannot demand payment from b for the voluntary services not asked by b another example a rendered some service to b on his request later b agreed to pay a for the service done a can now recover the amount promised from b here the promise is made on past consideration capacity to contract both the parties must be capable of entering the contract person of sound mind and having attained majority is capable to enter into a contract agreement with person of unsound mind for example idiot minor insolvent disqualified under law like convicts persons of alien enemy etc is not valid as such person is not competent 
to make contract free consent there must be genuine free consent of the parties the parties must have free will to enter into con- a contract without anyone subjected to undue influence coercion fraud misrepresentation mistake etc example a under threat to kill forces b to execute a promissory note of rupees 10000 in b's favor a is not bound to pay as it was obtained against his free consent lawful object the object of the agreement must be lawful agreement with unlawful objects immoral opposed to public policy etc are not enforceable example a promises to b to get unlawfully an employment in public service commission on payment of rupees 1 lakh to him b cannot enforce a to get the job nor a can demand payment for securing the job to b as the object of the contract is not lawful certainty an agreement must be certain and not vague or indefinite example a says to b i sell 100 kg of oil this is not a valid contract the object oil is not specified the date of payment delivery is also not specified the price is not specified such agreements are not enforceable statutory rules statutory requirements if any for example in writing stamped registered etc if any under the respective law must be fulfilled though in general oral or written contracts are equally enforceable however some rules require that written adequately adequately stamped document in such cases the statutory requirements must be fol- followed to be enforceable in a court of law example a says to be his son i sell this house to you at rupees 12 lakhs b agrees this contract is not valid as sale deed of immovable property requires to be written and registered as per rules but otherwise normally an oral contract is valid and enforceable performance the contract must not be impossible to perform example x says to b he will pay rupees 5000 to b if b's son marries a's daughter b's son was dead so there is no contract consensus the parties should agree upon the same thing in the same sense it means that the contracting parties must have similarity of understanding about the subject matter there is a meeting of mind of similar thought example a had two cows one black and another white a offered to sell a cow to b at rupees 20000 and b accepted A meant to sell the white cow but B thought A offered to sell black cow now there is no consensus at idem both parties are not thinking of same things hence there is no contract between them